Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you're new. My name is Appa in case you guys are new here. Today I have another Timu haul. I am so excited. This is a non-sponsored video. This is a combination of multiple different orders. So I'm gonna try to go by category this time because that's not something I have done in the past, I don't think. And uh, I don't wanna bore people with my videos, so yeah i do have some bonus items from big lots which i will show you guys in the beginning and then we're gonna move by category so this is gonna be a combination of craft jewelry and then some loungewear slash clothing items so starting with the big lots items i found the cutest mugs okay like i love mugs and unfortunately, I'm not like settled right now. I'm kind of living this nomadic lifestyle as a single woman. So I don't have a house, so I don't want to buy like a bunch of like things which I don't really need, you know, even though, you know, some of these items from Timu I don't really need. But hey, I got to keep myself like entertained during the time that I have here in this town that I live in okay so this is a baking themed mug look at how cute this was three dollars at big lots it says baking addict inside i got this for my mom because she is a baker so am i actually but i don't really have a lot of people to bake for right now but i was really happy to find that the other item that i ended up getting from big lots this was six dollars this is life happens when coffee helps i got this mainly for work because i lost my coffee mug my to-go coffee mug i don't know exactly what i did with it i don't know if i left it at work but I just haven't been able to find it. Okay, moving on to Timu items. The first item that I have here for you is this really large poster. It is um, basically like a mental health poster and I wanted something like this as a reminder for myself and uh, just to work on myself and my mental health. That's something that I really have been working on this year and basically it's kind of this folder where what you can control and what is like out of your control and i uh, thought this was really good just like uh, really inspiring and it, like having something like this in your home especially if you struggle mentally with your mood and such you know like this this is a good one i think this would also be a good one for someone who's a therapist and they have an office and they want to like put that in their office when they're doing you know their sessions and stuff i think it would be a good one they had multiple different types of things like this but i just picked up this poster so i'm excited to put that somewhere in my space then in case you are new to this channel i am big on crafting i'm currently obsessed with two different crafting hobbies one is embroidery i absolutely love embroidery i have been creating a lot of embroidery stuff and then secondly actually three different crafting not just um, embroidery second one adult coloring i actually have an adult coloring haul as well and then the third thing is planners i am absolutely obsessed with planners journaling anything like that so the first couple of items that i did get from timu which i would highly recommend if you are into embroidery are these thread packs from a brand called iro you guys this is better than dmc i'm telling you i got this one in like a pink slash reddish theme i got this one in a blue theme this one is more of a brown slash neutral also it's raining a lot so i apologize that the lighting is not the best um it gets really rainy here in upstate new york and then this one which is like oranges that would be perfect for fall uh projects and then this one which is more of a gray slash black thing so i have used this brand before i've talked about this in my previous videos timu videos and this is like amazing if you are into embroidery 
please 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 go check this brand out because it is amazing the next item which is also crafting related is this macrame kit that i ended up getting and this is supposed to be like a christmas themed one so i like that they're not traditional colors although i love the traditional colors for fall um you know winter and stuff i do time to time enjoy like the pastels for you know the holidays so i'm so excited for this i have never done like a macrame type project before so i'm excited for it so really happy that i was able to find that i think i have another like macrame type kit i found it this is supposed to make a keychain i got the same colors so the keychain i don't know if i can show it to you guys because it's a really small picture so the keychain is supposed to look like that it's like a floral situation <laughs> and i got the same colors basically so i will be playing around with those and i told you guys you know i'm into journaling as well so i got this which is uh, basically bible markers or like bible book markers for my bible i have two different bibles i have a pink one which is lighter and i can carry that one outside the house and then i have a bigger one which is more heavy duty and it's you know a journaling bible as well so i wanted to have some tabs and i think this theme like this floral theme is gonna go really well with that bible so i'm excited for it and i can't wait to just use it then talking of some planner items i ended up getting this clear folder i am going to be making my own planner so that's the reason as to why i got that i got some loose leaflets for making my own planner so this is the weekly planner thing so that's the weekly format it's all undated so it works out and this is the to-do list so i have multiple different planners for my youtube page i shouldn't say planners but like journals and stuff for my youtube for my embroidery slash adult coloring and i kind of just want like one place to have all of the things that i like to do and my everyday tasks and stuff like that so that is the reason as to why i want to make my own planner there are ways that you can do like custom planning and stuff but i don't know i i think it's a little bit more expensive plus if timu has everything why not just get the items from Timo? then i got this really cool thing this is a magnet it's like a coffee shaped magnet and this is actually meant for your needles when you're doing stitching that is exactly what it's meant for so oh my gosh you guys i am so happy that i got these items because now i can tell myself I cannot be bored because I have all these projects to work on and there's no excuse for me to be bored in my apartment as I said I do live in a small town so sometimes you know things are limited but hey it is what it is embroidery hoops I got a pack of embroidery hoops this is the larger kind I will put the measurements down for you guys and then I got a pack of these so I prefer these over the wood ones because the wood ones that I did buy from Timu they were breaking I think it was made of bamboo and it was really cheap bamboo and it just kept breaking so I prefer these and the reason as to why I got so many is because I am making a gallery space in my apartment which I might have even talked about in one of my other videos but that's kind of what I'm working on and I think this is really going to come in handy the price really wasn't bad for a pack of 10 plus the same stuff same stuff at michael's joann's hobby lobby it's gonna cost you quite a lot of money so definitely if you're into crafting i highly recommend that you check out timu and then i have a couple of bookmarks here to show you so i really like these bookmarks because they're van gogh themed and this is like a heavy duty metal um bookmark and that's kind of what this one looks like it's like this rose gold um themed 
and I'm trying to find the blue one it's somewhere around here but I'll find it and then this one which I'm actually using right now and this is the book I'm currently reading I did haul that one from the Dollar Tree not too long ago and it's like white lily flowers it's so pretty like I wish the camera would do it any justice but it's just super pretty I just thought it was gorgeous okay so I was able to find the blue one and this is kind of what the blue one looks like isn't that gorgeous like oh my gosh Timu I don't know what you're doing but you're doing something and I have a big problem I also got a paint by numbers kit I haven't yet started the other one that I showed you guys so I need to be mindful a little bit like I need to finish all these projects before I'm like jumping on to another project this one this is kind of what this one looks like so whenever I get the chance I will try to do this one this one will go with my living room sage green is the color of the year so I am excited to you know do that okay talking of planner items I also got these dividers which they're kind of not the best quality but I think they will work and they're actually made of paper I thought it was gonna be like plastic but um, this is kind of what they look like they come in different uh, colors so this is more whimsical slash uh, butterfly this one is just you know random paints same thing here I couldn't find good ones so I just picked this one up I mean these are good too don't get me wrong lights and then basically floral design so I'm excited for these I can't wait to make my own planner because I've been wanting to do that for a while and I have a planner right now which I'm still using but for next year I do want to use like a different um, planner then I have this set of texto whiteners and you get a pack of seven one two three four five six six and I actually am using one at my desk right now and these are really great I have used them before and no complaints and then I have these acrylic stands to display my embroidery work I th think they have a specific name I'm just forgetting what the name is you can also display like your paintings and stuff easel I think the name is easel yeah easel basically these are uh, acrylic easels uh, to display your artwork so I got a couple of these uh, we'll see how they work I'm sure they will be fine and they were not broken so that was good I got this Bath and Body Works style holder it actually comes with the bottle as well but I don't really need the bottle I just needed this I'm actually gonna get a couple more of those then I got two perfumes you guys this one is by the brand she mang they're actually both by the same brand this is in toffee girl looks like that Little focus toffee girl it has a gourmand note to it but it's a very fresh gourmand if that makes any sense and then this one is milk cookie which smells exactly like vanilla and bakery basically now moving on to some accessory type items i ended up getting a bunch of socks so these actually come in a set and they're so cute i absolutely just love them you can find similar ones I think my phone is ringing but I'm gonna ignore it so you can find similar ones at Walmart as well so we have strawberry avocado oranges and then cherry I love like fruit related or fruit themed items and then this one is in pineapple so really cute and I am so excited to just wear them I work at the hospital so a lot of times I am wearing you know shoes which require me to have socks so 
you know it's just gonna come in handy i also got this set this is like different shades of pink and uh, peach and white so there's this light pink um peach color white color uh yellow ish and then this shade of pink so it's really nice and i am excited to try that i got a couple of jewelry items as well actually there's a decent amount in here so i'm just gonna keep going without any particular order so we have this earring it's like a fabric slash um pearl i don't know if you guys can tell let me just try to open it that would be a lot better so there it is it's really cute i love it and i'm excited to use it then we have this one and then i have this one which is more of a beach themed even though we are moving on to fall i just think this is super cute so nice this is kind of what this one looks like super excited for that then i have this set of earrings super cute Oh, just love it i love their jewelry and i've done like a timu jewelry haul as well before if you guys are interested i will link that one down below and we have this one super cute then we have this one which i think is supposed to be a dupe of the dior earrings this one It would be impossible for me to like list all of these. I wish I could, but it just would be impossible. It just is a matter of using certain keywords. And then this is a ring, which I don't usually wear rings, but let me actually see. Oh, wow. It's cute. It's cute. So excited for that. I have this necklace, which is a Christian necklace. And if you're new to my channel, I am a Christ lover. So excited to use that one. Then this one kind of reminds me of the beach. I know I'm like talking about the beach and we're almost over the summertime. So it's like this um, swirl, I guess you could call it, earring set. So excited for that. Yeah, so it's like this pearl necklace. Yeah, super cute. And then there's this necklace as well. It's also pearl themed. So they are these like really dainty necklaces. So this is kind of what this one looks like. So this is just a flower super cute this one is a bow charm i'm having like trouble focusing on this camera occasionally so that's that i have this uh, bracelet i believe so cute wow excited to just wear it around and then this necklace or earring this is also supposed to be like a dupe ish supposed to look like this i'm not going to show you the whole thing but this is what the charm is supposed to look like this is also a necklace there we go it's focusing on my face there you go and then i got this one which is a bumblebee cute 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 this is more of a costume jewelry i guess you could call it so it is coming a little bended like the back of it but this is kind of what it looks like so we'll see if it still works out guys excuse the hair i'm just not having a very good hair day but this is one of the first pjs that i got from timu i honestly don't know if i'm gonna keep this or not um i don't mind it but I feel like it's slightly tight up here. I just don't really like the fitting of it. So I'm not quite sure if I want to keep this one. Um, 
yeah so this is a maybe but i'm just not sure okay guys so i also got this in this light blue color hopefully you guys can see i'm likely not going to keep it um even though it fits fine and i could probably sleep in it okay but the shorts is what is uh getting to me that it just doesn't um fit right you know in this crotch area so i'm probably going to return these okay guys oh my gosh talk about baggy clothes so this sweatshirt it says pumpkin season on it i don't know if you can tell it's just too big for my taste i wanted a sweatshirt which i can like wear outside the house and it's just it's too big the pants um i'm not sure if i'm digging this jogger style um i do have a couple of joggers which i like better from walmart so i'm not sure if i'm gonna keep the pants either i'm just very picky when it comes to my clothes and the way they kind of look on me so i'm likely gonna return both of these okay guys so we have um coffee weather just i don't know i just don't like oversized things on me and yeah it's really cute i love the top maybe i'll get a smaller size i don't know but uh, probably a return as well guys so we have this one this one says faith love or sorry faith hope and love and did I just buy the wrong size? I have a feeling I just bought the wrong size, you guys. Um, so, again, probably an exchange slash return. I think I bought the wrong size, you guys. <laughs> again, it's a really cute shirt. So maybe an exchange for this one. It says California the... California the California Poppy, I think. Flower Market. Um, cute too big it just makes me look bigger than what i actually am and that's why i'm like returning these items this is a really cute one as well it says god is still write your god is still writing your story okay it's cute but again just too baggy for me too baggy for my style i know some people can pull off like super baggy uh tops like this um, sweatshirts and such but I personally like for me that's not something I really enjoy so I may may not again exchange this okay first keep out of all of the items that I have been showing you so it is slightly tight here but it's fine I like this one I am likely gonna keep it Definitely with a different set of pants. I'm just gonna use like a regular leggings not these uh, jeggings But definitely keeping this maybe I'll look for more items from this particular um, Brand because Timu is not a brand right? It's like Amazon so they have multiple different brands, but look how cute you guys It's like pumpkin spice everything and I love <laughs> pumpkin spice so much fall is my favorite time of the year so i'm excited to keep this one okay now we have this jacket and i'm gonna do the same thing i'm gonna go for a smaller size because that would look better on me i feel like because it should be it should be like this you guys it shouldn't be this baggy this is definitely like a larger size so gonna return this you guys so the next item that i have here is this really pretty dress don't get me wrong it's very pretty however i feel like this circumference right here is not long enough for my body type as you can see like the this part this band part is like all the way up here it should be a little bit more down like that um so for that reason, I'm just going to return it. It's really pretty. It's comfortable. But I just have so many dresses. And I would rather just get my money back and get dresses from Shein. Um, but it's cute. You know, nothing wrong with it. It's just that it doesn't work with my body type, I don't think. Okay, guys. So the next item is sleepwear. That's kind of what the bottom looks like. I'm going to keep this because obviously for sleepwear you know you want loose things so i'm gonna keep it 
It also comes with shorts, so that's kind of nice. So for summer, you can, you know, wear the shorts, and then for winter, you can wear the long pants. Okay, guys, so that was it for this Timu haul. Now I have to, like, go through these items and start packing so I can return them. But I did enjoy um, the craft stuff I got. Like, I'm keeping all of the craft stuff. So thank you so much, you all, for watching, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.